Sony A6000 on the top, the GoPro on the bottom. They don't look very straight. Here I got my Sony A5000. That's a 50 millimeter lens I bought. Uh, it's 200 bucks, 50 millimeters, 1.8. I want to try to compare the video between the two cameras. Boy, you guys look lopsided. Let me, let me do a little adjustment here. Now, uh, maybe a little less lopsided that way. But I bought this camp table today at a pallet store in Johnstown. We're out running around shopping. Check this out. I got this for five bucks. It sells for, I think, $38 at Walmart. And I was just telling Jessica, I said, we need a camp table, a small camp table to put our stove on. And so, lo and behold, for $5, we find this little gem at a uh, one of them pallet stores where they do the Amazon returns and all that stuff. And I thought, how groovy is that? That is exactly what we were looking for. We're getting ready to go on a trip. We, we call it the trip with no name because we've tried it twice and failed. So the third time should be a charm. And uh, I don't want to jinx us by not, by, by naming the trip. But we got this for five bucks. Five dollars. And the only thing that's missing is this one corner right here. And uh, pretty neat. There's my Sony A5000. There's my GoPro Hero 3 Silver. And of course, I got the GoPro 7 black on the tripod. And the Sony A6000 on the tripod. And I could back the table up a little bit, couldn't I? The microphone is actually plugged into the GoPro, but it is sitting on the Sony. Because there wasn't enough room. There wasn't enough room to mount it on top of the GoPro. So, I got the Sony A6000 on the top, the GoPro on the bottom. They don't look very straight. Here I got my Sony A5000. That's a 50 millimeter lens I bought. Uh, it's 200 bucks, 50 millimeters, 1.8. I want to try to compare the video between the two cameras. Boy, you guys look lopsided. Let me, let me do a little adjustment here. Now, uh, maybe a little less lopsided that way. But I bought this camp table today at a pallet store in Johnstown. We're out running around shopping. Check this out. I got this for five bucks. It sells for, I think, $38 at Walmart. And I was just telling Jessica, I said, we need a camp table, a small camp table to put our stove on. And so, lo and behold, for $5, we find this little gem at a uh, one of them pallet stores where they do the Amazon returns and all that stuff. And I thought, how groovy is that? That is exactly what we were looking for. We're getting ready to go on a trip. We we call it the trip with no name because we've tried it twice and failed. So the third time should be a charm. And uh, I don't want to jinx us by not by by naming the trip. But we got this for five bucks, five dollars. And the only thing that's missing is this one corner right here. And. Uh, pretty neat. There's my Sony A5000. There's my GoPro Hero 3 Silver. And of course I got the GoPro 7 black on the tripod and a Sony A6000 on the tripod. I could back the table up a little bit, couldn't I? The microphone is actually plugged into the GoPro, but it is sitting on the Sony because there wasn't enough room 
there wasn't enough room to mount it on top of the GoPro and then mount it to the tripod. That's my National Geographic uh, tripod I bought off Amazon for 30 bucks used. Normally $65. Don't mind the out of date uh, porch furniture. We got it free too. I get everything free. Except my expensive camera here. I got this one free. Still works, but doesn't have image stabilization, so it's kind of useless, sort of. But I did an upgrade from the Sony A5000 to the uh, Sony A6000. And I have, I think, a 5500 in the house, but it's broke. It doesn't work anymore. And I put the kit lens on there for the video. Uh, I think it's a 35 by 55 or something like that. But I bought this 50 millimeter 1.8. I'm pretty impressed with it. It does pretty good. This camera in itself, I don't believe its video quality is very good. Let's try it. 